everyone, my name is Sierra and I'm the Social Media and Digital Marketing Coordinator. And the Carolina Housing staff and I are so excited for Move-In, which is coming up very fast. And we wanted to share some useful tips that you may be unaware of regarding student staff opportunities, the package center, technology issues, and anything else regarding Move-In. First, you're going to hear from Becca Gillison, the Assistant Director of Student Staff Recruitment. If you're interested in applying for a position, there's lots of ways to learn more about it. Um, the best way that I recommend is talking to someone who's already in the position. So if your students are here for orientation or during move-in weekend, they're gonna meet a lot of our current student staff. Ask them some questions. What is it like to be an RA? How is it working at the front desk? You know, start up that conversation. That's really gonna help with connections, getting them to you know, get exposure to what it's like working on campus. Thank you so much for that helpful information, Becca. Next, Gina Flo, one of the UNC Package Center managers, wanted to share a tip to make sure that you receive your packages on time. When you are addressing your packages, it is vital that you have all of the appropriate information on the label. So that is your full address, including your the street address and the room number, and your first and last name. And all that information is extremely important because we have so many on-campus residents that there are people with duplicate names, there are even people with duplicate names in the same building. So having first, last, and room number, all of those pieces of information are very important to ensure that you get the correct package. Thanks, Gina. Up next, we have Jordan Cady. She is the Assistant Director of Assignments. She is going to explain why checking your email is so important. We're going to send all of our housing communication to the UNC email that we have on file. We don't email parents directly, um, although we do have a great newsletter that we want your folks to sign up for, but we want to email you as the student, and it's your responsibility to make sure that you're kind of aware of what's going on. Now on to Jordan Jackson. He is the Assistant Director of Community Engagement, and he's going to tell us about the benefits of building a strong relationship with your resident advisor through Tar Heel Talks. I want to talk about Tar Heel Talks. Um, so these are opportunities throughout the year where you'll get to sit down one-on-one -on -one with your RA and kind of talk about your experience. Um, we know that there are lots of challenges and things that come up as a part of being a student, um, and we want to make sure that we're offering you support um, and helping you through the process of solving those problems. And finally, we have Phil Young, the Director of ResNet, and Phil tells you how you can get help with your tech issues. If a student's experiencing technology issues, the easiest way to get help is to go to help.unc.edu. There's a variety of ways to get help there from chat, phone, email. There's also a knowledge base on there, so if you are wanting to figure out a problem on your own, you can go right in there and solve that. Help.unc.edu, actually, you can put a ticket there, and many times it will go to our student employees, our RCCs, their residential computing consultants, and they'll come to your room and help you. Thank you so much for coming along with me today, and I hope you learned something new. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out, and we can't wait to see you soon.